Mohamed Salah's injury has worried his entire home country. The Premier League Golden Boot winner suffers from a strain in his left shoulder ligament, which his club says requires up to three weeks in recovery. Mo's performance in the 2018 Russia World Cup is in jeopardy. He's an exceptional Egyptian, the first to reach to that level of professionals and to break so many records. Mohamed Salah represents more than half the attacking power of the Egyptian national team. In the African Cup of Nations, Salah scored five goals, the rest of the team scored three. His presence in matches in itself puts pressure on opponent teams. Losing Salah is like losing hope for Egypt to play well in the World Cup. Worrisome over Mo's condition reached the Egyptian presidency. On Sunday, President El Sisi tweeted about his phone call to Salah. He said he found the Egyptian star strong and excited to continue the World Cup road. Mo too has reassured his fans on social media, indicating his confidence that he will be in Russia. Salah's injury should last from two to three weeks, so he may be ready. Injuries need two things, a good healing process and physiotherapy. It's why the Egyptian Football Association is sending a team to monitor Salah's recovery. They both want him to be treated in London to get the best medical care there is. Psychologically, Salah's tweet shows that he is determined to be in Russia. Hopefully he'll participate from the first match. I don't think the injury will impact his performance. Egypt's first match in the World Cup is the toughest in the group. On June 15, the Pharaoh's first appearance in the competition in 28 years will be against Uruguay. That's two days earlier than when Mohamed Salah's three weeks recovery plan ends. That's why many are in doubt that even if Mo recovers before his doctor's expectations, he may not be in his best shape during Egypt's first World Cup match. Adel Mahrouis, CGTN, Cairo.